Hello my loves, welcome to a new video. Today I have a, what have I got? I have got a Primark summer haul for you. <laughs> if you would like to see the bits that I picked up, then stay tuned. <music> Hello and welcome back to a new video. I'm going to cover over this bit because I feel a little bit booby today. Um, if you are new here, hi, my name's Jodie. Welcome to this video. And if you're returning, thanks very much for tapping on today's video. Today we have a Primark Summer Plus Size Haul. You guys know I love to go in Primark and see what I can get. See what, what us plus size women can actually fit in in Primark. So I popped in the other day and there were so many new summer dresses. So I picked up the ones that I could find that were... I was slightly on the bigger side. Um, I found a couple of 22s and I think the rest of them were 20s. So I was just like, do you know what? I'll bring it home and give it a try. Um, and I guess if you are lower than a size 22, size 20, these um, some of these dresses will be good for you. There was one that was uh, a little bit too tight, but you'll see in the try on. Um, but yeah, if you are new over here, I do everything to do with plus size fashion because I absolutely love it. I love inspiring a plus size woman to step out of her comfort zone and try new things, try new styles, try new colours and really live your best life in the clothes that you want to wear that you think that you can't, but you you really can. So I love to um, inspire you ladies uh, to try new things. I love skincare, hair care and makeup. So there's a bit of beauty over here and I'm also a mummy. So I do a little bit of lifestyle vlogging over here too. So if that sounds like a channel you would like to watch and be part of, I would love it if you would become part of my YouTube family. All you need to do is click the big red subscribe button below this video and don't forget there's a not notification button. If you tap on that it will not notify you every time I've uploaded a new video and at the end of this video if you do enjoy it don't forget to give me a thumbs up and do comment down below because I love to hear from you I love knowing what you guys have picked up from Primark um, and just I love to talk and really get to know the people that follow me so do comment down below so we can have a little chat down in the comments Okay, so to to start off, I don't know what I was going to say then. To start off, I picked up this holdall stripey kind of sailor looking bag, um, which is like blue uh, stripe with white canvas background. And I just thought I'd, I'd pick it up and show you. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it because I actually just thought to myself, I picked up a similar bag from the charity shop for four pounds. Um, so I may not keep this, but I just really liked um the size of it and i just felt like this is like a really kind of nice summery summer look summer looking holdall bag um it feels really nice and sturdy it's kind of like a canvasy material it's got an additional long handle so you can um put the long handle on and it is really quite roomy on the inside you've got a zip on the inside and you've got this side pocket here so um yeah this is the first item and i liked it i just thought it was different um and if you're going to the beach or you are going on holiday and you need something like that's a little bit bigger than a handbag, this could be uh, this could be work perfectly for you. So that was the first item that I picked up. Um, and then next I picked up a blue scarf, which I haven't I haven't I've got a few scarves, but I don't ever wear them. And I really look really like the look of this blue one, and I just thought this is just a nice little thing to sort of throw around your neck just to accessorise. And also, um, if it's a little bit chilly and you just want something to cover your neck, um, you've got this kind of lovely lightweight. Oh, you could also put this on your bag. You can accessorise this in so many different ways. And it was just £2.50 and it's just beautiful. It's 100% polyester. Um, but yeah, I just really love the colour of it and I just thought I could do something with this so I picked it up because the scarves that I have got I think I'm just going to get rid of them because they're like patterned and I'm just not really into that anymore but I do love a block colour and I do feel like I really like blue I don't know whether it suits me if it is one of my colours but I just really like this sort of um kind of what is this called 
periwinkle blue I think it's called or something like that so yeah so I picked that up for £2.50 there was other colours as well um, and then I picked up this red um, kind of sil satiny silky um, scarf you could put it around your neck or put it on your head so it's showing you all the different ways here and this was three pounds um, and I just I don't know how I'm gonna wear this but I just really like the look of it I don't know if I'll put it around my neck and just tie it at the side or you could um, sort of pop it in your hair as well but I do love a bit of red so I thought you know what get in my basket get in my basket and this was three pounds so yeah just a, a few little accessories i'm gonna just pop it back on this um little bit of card just so i can keep it nice and neat because i know me i will just it will get all creased and that will bother me so i've just popped it back on there just so it doesn't crease up too much so for three pound and they had these in different colors as well so yeah um nice little sort of accessory so next i picked up myself another one of these ribbed um vests they're um like a rib material got a nice bit of stretch in them one pack one pound fifty i wish they were one pound fifty five pounds and i got it in a xl i bought this um in the white a couple weeks ago and i've been wearing it loads so i thought you know what i pick up a black because i can wear this with my linen like trousers my white linen trousers my black and white linen trousers like you could wear this with shorts like it's a nice little basic layering piece so um yeah really like that and they wash up really well as well to be honest so for five pounds can't go wrong so next is this vest here and i just really love this when i see it like red i love red um i haven't got a try on clip on this because i did try it on and i just felt like it it looked a bit small i tried it on the other day when i got home um and it looked it's not that it looked small it fitted me but it's got this inside bit like a booby bit and that's too short and it then makes the seam sort of like pop out of the front which was really annoying however if you are kind of like you know size 20 or below and you want a bit of pop of color why not try one of these i liked the square neck of it as well and the straps are a kind of a really nice size that you could still wear your bra underneath um but yeah i really liked this and so i thought i'd pick it up but yeah like i said i just feel like it's a bit too small so i think i'm gonna send this back and um yeah it was five pounds so that is that um, so I actually went back to Primark and picked up a few other bits. So I'm just going to insert this video just to show you a few bits that I picked up from Primark after I filmed this video. Um, and I think that they were they're worth a, like a, a C for you guys to maybe go and pick up if you're going on holiday um, or, you know, if you want some new bits for the summer. So I actually picked up this bag here um we are going on holiday and i really wanted a new kind of uh straw sort of uh bucket bag as you will um you all know that when i've been doing my try-ons i have that one kind of straw bag which is really old and i said to you i really wanted to get something that was the same um because it is looking a bit worn and worse for wear so i wanted something that wasn't too expensive that was going to kind of replace that one um and this certainly does i really love the shape of it i love the uh brand handles and you guys know these bags are really expensive at the moment everywhere i look they're quite pricey so this one was nine pound um it was nine pound and it's got a zip at the top which i loved so a lot of these bags are kind of open bags and you um there's easy access and anyone can stick their hands in so i like the fact that it had the closed zip on the top of it um it's really quite roomy in there as well i've got some other bits in there which i'm going to show you but i thought this was worth a show and um definitely one for like the summer or if you're going on holiday and you just want that kind of kind of beachy holiday look summer look then this is definitely one to pick up there was a few different kind of straw looking bags but i will say 
out of all of them this one looked the more kind of expensive a little bit more um nicer made so yeah i uh, picked that up and i wanted to show you so we are going on holiday very very soon so i picked up some holiday bits and i thought i'd show you if you want a full in-depth holiday video of what we've picked up for holiday then i could do that just comment down in the comments um let me know that you'd like to see a full holiday primark shop and i can show you the full spill of what i bought because there's quite a bit um but i'm just going to show you the bits that i bought for myself because that's what we're here for um so i also picked up these hats here as you can see i've had my hair done and we're going to be in the heat it's going to be hot so i wanted something to cover my face i did have one of these and um, I took it away to Turkey with me and I can't remember where I put it. However, I like the these ones because they're an open back so I can just literally um, pop it on like this and wear it to cover... Um, to cover my face in the sun and it actually feels a lot more um comfortable it doesn't feel like it's really tight on my head um and i just thought yeah this is perfect um to cover me in the heat when we're on holiday so i picked up this color here and i also picked it up in the black i don't know how much these were because they're as you can see there's no price on them um but i can't imagine there being any more too much more than like just over five pounds so i also picked it up in the black um and they're just great to uh, shield you from the sun i have had my fair share of heat stroke and i really don't want that again so making sure you take all the things that you need to make sure you don't have heat stroke or sunburn and stuff like that is very important so this is um, an essential for me um and then next which i've already taken out of the box or i didn't take it out of the box my son took it out of the box i when i was about to pay i um see these but there was only bright pink and i know that my son would want one of these so I'm hoping that when I go into Primark again, I'll find another one. If not, then I have been looking on Amazon and I have seen some, but they're a little bit more pricey on Amazon. This was um, £6 and it's got a free um, free speed um, spin on it, which is cool. And it does, uh, I'm sure it bends so you can sit it on the side and just you know have it on the side or whatever but i just thought this was uh something that i i really want um when i'm on holiday because i get so so hot and actually um the only thing that i had i'm gonna pull it out of my drawer if i can um scoot her over the only thing i had really to protect me when i'm really really hot um is this fan which i keep in my drawer and i actually picked this up when i was in oops if i can get it out when I was in um, Ghana a few years ago because I was so hot in the market and I picked up this fan and now I just use it when I need at home um, but I will be taking this with me as well um, it is very very helpful when you are really really hot um, but I have this one too so um, I thought I'd show you that then I also picked up so I put I'm going to show you some of the holiday bits that I picked up but I picked up these packing cubes I, I love using packing cubes if if you know me then you'll know i'm very organized and i like everything to be just put so um and these really do help uh with me and making sure my suitcase is in order and i like to just pack everything in each one so i know where everything is and when you open your suitcase at the other side it's all neat however i was looking on tiktok yesterday and i see that there's compression uh, packing cubes which look really good and i'm so tempted but i bought these ones for five pounds and um these are really really helpful when packing a suitcase so these are what i actually came on to to show you because i think that they're worth uh they're worth a look and are worth picking up so these are the seam free control bum lift shorts and I, as I was about to pay, the shop was closing and I came across these. I actually see it on the mannequin and I was like, I'm really look, I'm like on the eye for um, shorts to wear under skirts. As you guys know, you know, ladies get a bit chafing when you're walking and you let your thighs are a little bit bigger than your, your thighs rub together. So a lot of uh, women wear cycling shorts underneath or, you know, some type of kind of um, prevention like to 
help with that. So I see these and that the, was the main thing that I thought, oh, these look that they'd be good. However, I they're meant to be bum lifting shorts. I did put them on and I don't think they lifted any part of my backside, if I'm honest. But they were so comfortable and they were really sort of smoothing so they smoothed me all out my tummy area and they come up really really high so they came up under my bra and i love that so the other ones that i picked up from marks and spencers the other day they didn't come as high as my bra which which i really wish that they did and also they kept rolling up at, on my thigh like on my the my thigh so as i was walking they were rolling up and i kept feeling like i needed to pull them down i haven't tried and tested these in terms of worn them out but when i put them on they are so nice because they're just so high and they're so smoothing over the tummy area i really thought that these were worth a show um so they were seven pound each and i picked up the size 2xl which is a 22 24 however when as you can see this has got a bit of sellotape on it because it was the um only i see two with this 2xl on which were in the black and these ones were in the sand colour. So I picked them up I, and I I see that it had been open, but I didn't. I was in a rush and I didn't look at the actual um, pair inside. Um, and when I looked, when I got home, it's actually an XL inside. So this is the size 1820. However, I tried it on and they fit. So I'm not going to return them because there wasn't any other 2224s. So I'm going to actually keep them. But this is what they look like at the back. As you can see here, you've got this kind of like looser kind of thinner material on the bottom bit. So they're not, your bottom's not compressed, but everywhere else is. And I definitely say that these give you a little bit of kind of, um, kind of, it kind of, it doesn't really like, it doesn't do well factors like, you know, the um, skims or whatever. But these are, for £7, I think, really good. And I love the fact that they come right high up up under your um, bra. So all of the front of you is all nice and smooth. It's not, suffer they're not suffocating. They're not too, too tight. They're just really nice. And so, like I said, I picked up the sand colour, which is great for my, sort of like a nude pair. And I also picked them up in the black um, and definitely think that these are worth a, like a try. So if you see these in your Primark, go and give them a go, buy one pair, see how you feel. If you're not into shapewear or you, um, or look, if you're just wanting to buy some shorts for your legs, give these a go. It'll give your tummy a little bit of a smoother effect and you've also got the um, protection for your thighs as well. So highly recommend these. I do have some other holiday bits, which should I show you? Um, maybe I'll show you those quickly. I did pick up another little vest. This is in a XL. It was £2.50. And I wish that they had the 2XL, but they only had a 1XL. But I just felt like, do you know what? I'm getting through these. Like, I'm wearing these a lot. And they're just kind of little staples. And I can wear them underneath things. So, um, I picked up one like this. That, because the others that I picked up from Primark are ribbed. So, I really wanted just like a smooth kind of cotton material or stretchy material. And that's what this one is. So, I picked up that. And then, um, I'll also show you. I picked up some beach towels. These. So, I went into m and and I had a look at theirs. I went into the MS outlet and I had a look at theirs. And they were £8.50. But when I opened the towel out, they were rather quite small. So I was just like, oh no, I think I'll leave them. And then when I went into Primark, I see these ones. And they're so much bigger. Like perfect for my size and just like an, a nice big adult size um, beach towel. So I picked up this colour. Um, I also picked up the blue and navy, which is really, really nice. Like blue and navy, white and navy. <laughs> and I also picked up the pink and white. So, um, yeah, these are the few little bits that I wanted to jump on and quickly add into this video. But I, like I said, I'd highly recommend these shorts. They are really, really nice. And actually... The nicest pair that I've tried on in a long, long while. So, yeah, just wanted to add this little in, little bit into the section. Right, now you can get back into the other day, Jodie.
Um, so next up, but I'll show you this dress that I'm wearing and I'll show you the cutaway of it on. It's in a size 22. Um, it reminds me a little bit of that uh, picnic dress. Um, I think it was from my last ASOS haul, but the the one in the ASOS haul, it was kind of ill-fitting. It wasn't fitting me properly. However, this fits me perfectly. The sizing's perfect. I just really like it. It's just a really nice dress. And I love the colour of it as well. It's something very different. Um, it's a bit more muted, a bit more nat like a neutral, natural colour. Um, and yeah, I, I like the style. We've got a bit of shearing on the back. And the bottom skirt of it is like really quite a lot of material. So it's quite flowy. Uh, and yeah, I just liked it. So I think this was £16 or £18, one of the two. And I went in size 22. And you will see what it looks like in the clip. So this is the first item. Um, they, to be honest, this haul wasn't like an absolute winner for me. There were just... Um, one or two things that i really liked um and everything else is a bit like it's okay but um we plod on and i'm going to show you the next item so next is this kind of like linen blend dress and it's this really like sort of dark khaki color and i really love a linen dress i've really I've really started to kind of learn that I do like that um, and I have a few now that I have purchased this summer and um, I just I'm loving linen at the moment so when I see this I was like oh this looks really nice the sleeves look really nice it's got this sort of lovely sort of square neckline however this is in a size oh it actually is in a size 22 but it was too small for me now there's not, no stretch in it and probably the cut of the dress, the way it's cut, wasn't really allowing me to feel comfortable in this. It was too tight around my bust and just too tight just um, underneath my bust in my waist area. However, if you are a size 22 and below, if you're more on the smaller size side of a 22, because I actually feel like I'm more on a sort of middle 22 or maybe like I kept saying I'm 22, 24, but I know I'm not 24 now uh, in dresses. I'm a 22, but I would still say I'm more of a prominent 22. But if you are sort of a 20, 22, I think this would um, like fit you very well at a size 22. I feel like maybe these run a bit small um, and like it's linen, so there's no stretch in it. But I just really love the cut of this dress. I think it looked really nice on had it fitted me properly. Um, the length is lovely. Did it have pockets? No, it doesn't have any pockets. The length was really nice and I just love the cut of it. I really like this dress, but again, it was too small for me. So you would have seen in a cutaway what it looks like. I would highly recommend trying this dress on, even though it didn't work for me. Anyway, let's get the next one. So next, you can tell that in this haul, there were so many kind of neutral, natural colours. Like when I went into Primark, everything that I kind of looked at, like the big sections were kind of neutral, natural colours. And this was another dress that really um, kind of jumped out to me. I love the cut of this dress. This dress is kind of like the same cut of the dress that I tried on, the black one that everybody went mad for and was like, I love that dress. And it was from the Primark edit. Um, and it was black it wasn't a linen material though um, but this is like a linen material and this has this kind of like stone detail um, just around the neckline here and honestly I really like this I think I'm going to keep this and wear this on holiday this is in a size 20 and it was 20 pounds it is so nice it's got pockets i just love the way this fits me i really like it you'll see what it looks like on the try on it fits me fine at a size 20 um i would wear 22 I would wear size 20. Um, so really, really like this. Really nice dress. Love the colour of it. It's kind of a bit more it, it, it looks a bit browny on on the on sort of the the screen, but it is a khaki green colour. And um yeah, I just I love this. I just this is a bit of me all over so uh this is this one and yeah like i said it was 20 pounds and this is an, a size 20 so next we have another white dress you know what i'm like when i see a white dress um however this didn't fit me um properly i mean it fitted me but 
it just wasn't very comfortable around the bust area so it's a size 20 and it was 25 pounds um and it's the embroidery and and glaze but brew glaze i can't say it <laughs> um so yeah i i loved sort of the puff sleeve of this and i love the fact that you could either wear it on your shoulders or off your shoulders you'll see in a cutaway i took it off my shoulders um i just didn't like this sort of whole cut out cut out here because i have to wear a bra i cannot go braless um and so you could see my bra in this section so i didn't like the fact that it had this hole here if that hole wasn't here then i would probably like this a lot more than i do um i love the shearing back uh, a sheared back bit as well so you've got that stretchy bit at the back we all have a bit of shearing um and it does have like an undercoat like it has like a sort of lining underneath so you're not going to see your underwear um beneath it's not all the way lot like it's the lining isn't right the way down to the bottom of the skirt it comes sort of halfway but it does cover over your underwear so that's kind of great anyway um you know i like this dress but i've tried better white dresses on if i'm honest i've got better white dresses so um yeah i wasn't blown away but i uh, like with this i think because i've tried a lot of white dresses and i think that, that i've tried some nicer ones on um but it's not a bad dress and actually um if you can go braless i think that you would like this dress and you know um i definitely think it's worth a try but it just wasn't for me so this is this one now let me show you the next so next we have this sh like sheer topped dress um kind of just like a really nice plain sort of summer dress and like sundress i think they call them um you've got adjustable straps at the top here and the top bits all shearing they did have this in black as well but hubby was like no get the um the, the green and cream color don't get the black so i picked up um this in this color oh i think the thingy fell off of it um i'm sure this is a size 20 and i think it was 16 pound from what i remember um I mean, it fitted okay. I probably would have liked a size 22 to have extra sort of material on the bottom half. But, I mean, I would still wear it at this size. So, i definitely say if you cannot find, like, a, your size, definitely try the size below because it's got a lot of stretching. And there is quite a bit of material at the bottom that you could actually probably make it work. And um, so, yeah, this is in an extra large. So an extra large, I think, an extra large, I think, what is an extra large? It says it on here. Oh, it doesn't say what it is. Oh, so an extra large is at 1820. So this is a size 1820 and it fitted me. So there you go, girls. Like, um, I'm a size 22, but I picked up a size 1820 and it fitted. It's got a stretch in it and it fitted around the bottom half of me. And that's the biggest part of me. That's where I hold my weight around my tummy. Um, and there was like enough room to sort of make me feel comfortable. So this dress was really, really comfortable. This is a dress that you kind of, when you feel like, I just want to be really comfortable today. The sun's out, it's hot. I don't want to get hot and bothered. This would be the perfect dress to pop on. So um, overall, I liked it. I wasn't completely blown away, like it didn't give me that wow factor, but a nice dress um, nevertheless. So that's this one and let's get the next one on. I'm looking down because they're down here. As you know, I wouldn't be Jodie if I didn't show you a blazer, would I? Um, but this is the next one. I actually don't know if I've done a try on with this. Uh, if I didn't, I'm going to have to do it after, but I don't remember if I did a try on. Um, it's just a uh, green, khaki green um linen blazer god god Jody. and it was 38 pounds so a bit more pricey because it was from the primark edit which is a little bit more pricey however this is a bit more of a fitted blazer you can see where it kind of nips in at the waist um so it gives you a little bit of shape i would say it's a little bit like a little bit small for me if i'm honest it's a size 20 i really would have loved this in a size 22 but they didn't have a size 20 and i don't think they i didn't have a 22 and i don't think they got to a size 22 in <clears throat> the primark edit so but I, I just felt like 
I wanted to pick it up and show you lovely ladies that, you know, if you love blazers like me, pick some up in linen and wear it through the summer as well. Um, so yeah, so this is this one. Um, and yeah, it was a bit more pricey, but I love a blazer. Okay, so lastly is another blazer but this blazer's got short sleeves. I mean, I've never seen. I don't. I don't think I've ever seen a blazer with short sleeves before. Maybe I have, but I just don't remember. And I was like, I was like, look at this. And I tried it on, and um, my hubby was like, I like that. And I was like, do you? And he was like, yeah, it's something different, but I like it. And then another another lady walked past me, and she was like, we used to wear those blazers in my day like that. And I said, really? And she said, yeah. She said, oh yeah, I used to wear them all the time the short sleeve ones i said oh I've, i don't remember ever seeing them she said yeah we used to wear them through the summer um so i just felt like i wanted to pick it up and show you i'm i don't know if i'm sold i don't think i am um however it is a really nice blazer it's beautiful white linen sort of creamy color with these beautiful buttons and it is just made really nicely like it feels really nice it's um 50% sust sustainable viscose, um, so it feels like linen, but it's viscose, well, 50%, and it was £26, and it's in a size extra large, so I could have done with an XX, but they didn't have it, and I just wanted to pick it up and show you, um, you know, if you would like to dabble in wearing a short sleeve blazer, go and give it a try, because it is something different um i'm not too sure if i'm sold i do love my long sleeves and you know it's so crazy because i always rush my sleeves up on my blazers anyway and make them more or less three quarters but this is not three quarters this is more like a t-shirt kind of length um like a long sleeve t-shirt if if you will um so yeah this is this one and i just I, I really do like it but i'm just not sure if i like it on me as much do you know what as well i've had my hair change and so when i try and close i feel different like it gives me a different kind of style or different kind of look and i don't like it very much i mean i like having my hair like this because it's less for me to do and it's nice to have a bit of a change but it really does change like my style in terms of my clothing because i kind of dress in a certain way that suits my hair tied back and with this type of hair, I just feel like some of my outfits don't look right now I've got my hair like this, which is actually so annoying. Anyways, um, there's worse things to be worried about in life, I guess, than, you know, a change of hair. <laughs> <laughs> um anyways lovely ladies that is the end of my primark call i hope you enjoyed it i guess it wasn't one of my best primark calls but certainly um there was a few bits that actually i really did love like i love the linen um green khaki green dress with the uh, little stones across and i'm definitely going to keep that i'm going to wear that on holiday and this one here i'm going to keep so these are the two pieces that i'm going to keep and obviously my little accessories definitely going to keep oh, whack myself in the head definitely going to keep this because i just feel like there's so many ways in which you can sort of accessorize with this and the black ribs that's definitely going to be kept i don't know i think i'll try this on again give it another go but yeah i think all the rest i may take back and i'm just going to keep the two dresses but i wanted to show you what else was new in primark i'll probably go in there and take this stuff back and then there'll be an extension to this video and i'm going guys i actually went back to take the stuff back and then i see some more stuff honestly i don't know how many times i've done that on videos <laughs> <laughs> but anyways thank you all for watching today and i hope to see you all in my next haul take care of yourself and god bless to you all Mwah. bye guys